What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Ole Miss versus Oklahoma Week 9 college football matchup going down Saturday, October 26, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love, including my daily $15 best bet, head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between Ole Miss and Oklahoma. And if you told me that this was going to be a matchup, on the card when uh, when uh, Oklahoma made the jump to the SEC. Probably would have been excited about it, but now not not so much, uh, <laughs> at least from one one side perspective. But you got uh, Ole Miss coming into this one with a record of 5-2 and two on the year, both straight up and against the number. After a 29-26 loss in the hands of LSU in their last game prior to last week's bye week, Oklahoma you know coming off a 35-9 loss in the hands of South Carolina in their last game, and it's been the third week of the last four where Oklahoma, you know, took one on the chin and uh, was held to 15 points or less. They've been held to 16 or less four times this season. Not a good look for Brent Venable's team. And, you know, especially when the bulk of those games are coming at home. Oklahoma's only made one ro true road game this season. That was at Auburn. And um, I'll tell you, you know, Auburn... You know, it was uh, it was a tough environment, but I mean, Oklahoma did get the win. The problem is, though, is that I'm not really giving Auburn too many brownie points. I mean, that's still not a very good Auburn team. And now, if you're Oklahoma, you got to go take on an Ole Miss team that you know is a little bit ticked off. They let one get away against LSU and an Ole Miss defense that's the best team in the country against the rush from a, a statistical perspective. You know, allowing just 66 yard rushing yards per game. They're top 15 in total defense. The passing offense could be a little bit better. They're 83rd in passing yards against per game. But here's the thing. Oklahoma's offense is so dead. They, there's nothing that this Oklahoma team can do right now. I mean, you have, you know, Michael Hawkins come out. He's ineffective against South Carolina. You have Jackson Arnold burn his red shirt, which was, which almost feels pointless for Oklahoma at this point, considering that Oklahoma's probably not going to be doing much of anything. And I think they're just trying to salvage bowl eligibility. But I don't even know if they're going to be able to do that with how bad this offense has been. They've been outscored 69-12 to 12 in the last two weeks. Granted, one of those was against Texas, but even then, that's a rivalry game that, that you can't afford to get blown out in. Now, like I said, you take on an Ole Miss team that is solid defensively, and from an offensive perspective, oh boy, second in in, uh, in total offense nationally, third in passing, and that's where you can really attack this Oklahoma defense. They have a, a weak secondary, 78th in passing yards against per game. They're decent against defending the rush, but I just think that Ole Miss is just the better team across the board here. And if Oklahoma, excuse me, if Ole Miss wants to actually be a two-loss playoff team, it's it's looking unlikely. But if they want that to be the, uh, if they want that to be their future, they have to put up style points and big ones. And like I said, it's not looking likely that Ole Miss is going to be able to do that. But right now, they need style points, and I think that they'll be able to get them here against this Oklahoma Sooners team that's just just not a good football team this year. So give me Ole Miss in this one. Give me Ole Miss in a beatdown, and that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. Why are your Pick Dogs? Check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.